Okay guys, so we are here with another Artsy Trio video. Uh, this month Mike Deakin has done the mood board for um, this month's challenge. Whoops, here we go. And you know, I don't know why I'm inspired by this to drag out my color pencils, which I never use. Uh, fun fact, they're not my favorite art supply. <laughs> And despite the fact that I haven't really purged them much, um, I have purged out the expensive pencils because I find when I do use them, I don't much care, bar a couple of colors, whether they're Crayola or whatever, because I'm not a color pencil artist. So Crayola, most of these are Crayola because Crayola is fine and affordable. Um, so I picked out some colors that I was inspired by the mood board. Um, again, I don't know why pencils came to mind, but they did. There's a lot of feathers on this mood board and that might be why the pencils came to mind. I also have one of my fountain pens. It's a water soluble ink one and a couple of water brushes filled with ink and one filled with water. And we are going to do some drawing. I think we're going to draw a feather. I'm really, I don't know how it's going to turn out exactly. I don't know if I'm going to add words to it or not. I have no idea. Although one particular word, single word, is coming to mind. We're going to find out. Um, the first thing we're going to do is take our mood board. And this is our art experiments journal. For those have, who haven't watched me work in this journal before, I do um, lots of different kinds of art experiments in here. Um, sometimes with the RC Trio mood board, sometimes not and um, with paint and ink and all kinds of different things. And then I make notes about what I did um, so that I can look back at it and go, okay, what was that that I did? Um, here's a good example of that where I was like, can we do an acrylic pour in a journal page? I have no idea, let's try it. Um, so I have a whole uh, playlist of Artsy Trio videos if you want to go back and watch them. Also, the new videos for my friend Mike Deacon and Bea Grob are listed in the description below. I will link my Artsy Trio playlist down there too. Um, we have a Facebook group where you can get this and all the past mood boards and um, play with them. Uh, the link for that is also, again, down below. All the relevant links, whether it's my Etsy shop or my social media, are all it's down below. Uh, anyway, um, so join the Facebook group. If you do create some artwork inspired by this mood board or one of the others, please post it. And um, if you would like to make sure that we see it, tag us in the post. And uh, let's get started, shall we?
Okay, did I know that that's where that was gonna go? No. Do I like what happened? Yes. It was fun. I mean, colored pencils still aren't my thing, but it's fun to play with them every now and then. So this month, with this mood board, not only do I wanna challenge you with the mood board, but I wanna challenge you to create something, no matter how complicated or simple, with your least used art supply. Can you do that? If you can and you create something, I'd love to see it. Share it with me over in the Facebook group. I'd love to see what you're doing. Uh, go check out the other videos and all the relevant links down below. Everybody's created really unique work this month, as always. All right, that's it for today. Stay safe, stay healthy, stay creative. Don't forget to go out and do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. And I'll see you later. Bye, guys.